action! They were crawling all over the smash hit film Bridesmaids. There's probably, I bet there's 25 groundlings in it. And it all began right here on Melrose, where the Groundlings Theater and School, founded in 1974 by Gary Austin, has produced some of the most iconic talent in comedy history. It's crazy how many people have come out of here. I particularly wouldn't be where I was without Gary Austin. He gave me uh, my first peewee suit. The, the peewee suit was, was his. Groundlings alum Mindy Sterling trained here, alongside funny folks like Lisa Kudrow and Kathy Griffin, and the dearly beloved Phil Hartman. This is Phil Hartman, Aww. look at this. Look at how young and sweet and how gorgeous. Wonderful. You probably know Mindy best as Frau Farbissina in the Austin Powers movies starring Mike Myers. I met Mike Myers here. Mike uh, was invited to come and do uh, some improv by uh, Julia Sweeney, and that's how we kind of formed this um, relationship. Do people still come up to you and... and... Always, always. <laughs> well, I could do a little bit, yes. You know, she's... Um, She's one of the dearest characters I ever did. Over the years, Mindy's helped many of our favorite comedy stars hone their quirky skills as a teacher at the Groundlings School. Things, right? Yes, I birthed, I birthed the comedy. I've been really, really lucky to have some amazing, amazing people that, you know, certainly have gone on to do some wonderful things. Mike McDonald from Mad TV, Sherry O'Terry, Chris Kattan. In fact, many now famous characters were born on the Groundlings stage. The Julie Sweeney is packed. She so created she that here. She developed that here. Yes, huh? she did. She created uh -huh. that here. And while Mindy showed me around the Wall of Fame from back in the day, a few more groundlings came sneaking in. We, we got this. Oh, <laughs> these, are, these are color photos, so I don't know if you're. <laughs> SNL's Taryn Killam and Stephanie Courtney, better known as Flo, who have their own favorite memories. I just feel like pointing out this sketch right here. <laughs> Melissa McCarthy right there uh -huh. performed this on our stage and then performed it um, on SNL. That's correct. And were you in that? That's Rex? correct. I, I got, I played Mikey. Yeah. I could drink the whole bottle. I could drink that whole bottle. Yeah. Oh, really, I love this I one. Could, yeah, I love it too. I really... <laughs> And I know you were a part of this sketch with Kristen, yes, right? Yes, I was. I was one of the airplane <laughs> passengers. So just make sure all of your atoms are neatly stowed <laughs> in your chair, just in case the plane does rip in half. Did you ever think that a commercial could change your life the way that Flow no. has changed your life? Not at all. I, I, I just sort of kept improvising, you know, a very emotional, happy. <laughs> it's sort of like my mom, emotional and happy. <laughs> and it's turned, we're gonna, I think we're gonna hit 100 commercials this summer. But you can see Stephanie is a very different character right here. Get as close to normal as you can get. Get a hobby. Join an after school club, etc. <laughs> Crazy Uncle Joe show, I don't know if you, Wednesday nights. 8 o'clock. Here, here, 8 o'clock here at the Grand Lakes Theater. Uh, yeah. That show I'm still in awe of and still afraid to do <laughs> because she and Jordan Black and Roy. Bri Jordan Brian and Roy Brian. are some of the fastest, funniest, uh, smartest improvisers I've ever seen. So if you want to see the superstars of tomorrow being made in L.A. today, check out the Groundlings performances every Wednesday through Sunday. I think Groundlings is kind of one of the hottest spots in LA to come mm -hmm. see comedy. It's definitely one of the holy grails.